Hey yo, what is up legends and welcome to a movie night, the very first edition that we have here on the channel and we are starting with an absolute classic that somehow I have never ever seen. People say to me all the time, how have you not seen this movie? It's like Cool Runnings. I always get it when I tell people I haven't seen that, but people say it over and over again, how have you never seen it? You have to see it and that is of course Saving Private Ryan. So this movie actually came out the year I was born, 1998. So of course I wouldn't have been able to watch it until I was much older because I know there's some heavy themes of war in the show, but going into this movie, I actually don't know much about it at all. I know it's based in one, one of the wars and it's about Saving Private Ryan. That's literally it. I've been told to take my tissues in, my, my housemate, has seen it and he said it's a great movie but it does get very heavy and the only other thing that I know about and this might not be true at all okay so tell me in the comments but I did hear that when the movie came out people would go to watch it and there was this thing where people who had actually been to war would get triggered with their PTSD during the movie because it was so similar to what the war was actually like that a lot of people couldn't handle it. So that maybe I'd misheard that and I heard that a long time ago and I've mixed it up. But if that was the case or something similar, please do let me know down in the comments. My housemate said that the only other thing I needed to let you guys know was that one, I am the oldest of two younger brothers. So I have two younger brothers, one that's two years younger and then one that is eight years younger than me. And one of them, so the middle, the middle brother is actually in the Australian Defence Force. He's in the Air Force. My housemate said that I had to let everyone know that as context, so there it is there. But I hope you legends have been having the most amazing day ever. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. We're on the path to 10,000 subscribers. It means the absolute world to me to have all of you here. And whatever you did today, I am super, super proud of you. And I know that you gave your absolute best and that is always all that matters. So I hope you legends are all set, all ready. And I think let's get into this next reaction. All right. It's based on World War II, I just saw in the little, in the description there. The other thing that was a tipping point for this for me was that I saw that Natalie Goldman had reacted to this and I've watched Natalie a long time before I even started my own YouTube channel. So I always have a drink, I always have a snack. But I saw that she had watched this and I was like, all right, it came up in my recommended and I was like, you know what? I should just watch it. So then people can stop saying to me and I've heard it's very good. Yo, this is DreamWorks, what the heck? They went from this to Kung Fu Panda? So this just looks like a normal dude living a normal life. Walking around with either his family or... No, he looks troubled, man. Like he's about to cry. Hmm, what's going on here? Ah, oh, he's at a graveyard. So I'm guessing this is one of the soldiers, right? And he's here to see all of his friends, probably. Hmm, so many. Just something our current generation just can't comprehend, like myself included, right? Oh man, this actor's doing a really good job of like, like I feel really sad for him right now watching this. Oh, and he's just an old man. I have no idea what it's like in other countries, but in Australia, like, the Australians that fought in the war are talked about a lot. You know, we have the Anzacs, and every year we obviously have Anzac Day, where it's a whole day, and it's always taught in school about what happened and the battles and the sacrifices, so the legacy carries on. Man, look, that actor is doing, s he looks so distraught in his eyes. Wow, it's a crazy shot. Is this about to transition? Oh, are these the things they're meant to stop the boats, right? They put holes in the boats when they come in. Oh, that guy's vomiting. It's just crazy, isn't it? Oh man, what is he eating? I thought that was a spider then. Or dirt. Oh, yuck. They're about to storm. Is this... No uh, see, I don't know the name super well. I want to say Normandy. Please, I'm very sorry if I'm wrong. I mean, no disrespect with it. I just can't remember the name right now. Oh, yo, this dude. I remember him being in a number of movies when I was younger. The whistles, yeah. I remember Peaky Blinders. They talk about the whistles all the time. Oh my God, holy shit. Just like that, just mowing them down. Holy shit, the film work on this is insane. 
Oh, that's deep water for how close they are. Oh my god. Please don't drown. Oh shit, how did they think to shoot the water? The camera work makes it just feel like, like I was holding my breath then and I didn't even realize. Holy shit. This is such an old movie, but this is so well done. <gasps> Did he just get shot? That happened so fast, I didn't even, I couldn't even tell. It's a horrible analogy, but it makes me think of, you know, when baby turtles are born and they have to go across the beach and just nearly all of them die because it's so, like, it's just, this is like suicide. It seems like a horrible plan. I obviously have no idea what's happening, but they're just being massacred. Oh my God, oh my God. He just lost his leg. <gasps> Oh my goodness. He's just in shock. Oh, that was a flamethrower. Oh my God. The stuff they're choosing to show is, huh? he's got no arm. He's looking for his arm. Oh my God. I can see why, if it was true that people were having, like, PTSD. I understand. What's the rallying point? Is anywhere but here? Yeah, right, we're just in hell. I don't know if this was meant to be a surprise, like them landing or what, but they're, clearly they were waiting for them and were prepared. Well, I don't know what that means, pre-sighted. I'm assuming that means like they've the sights on their machine gun, like it's with it's gonna be an accurate shot. I'm not sure. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have to bl oh man. I'm gonna have to blur so much of this. How can you think about that right now? Wait, he's gonna blow it up? That's crazy. How were they getting tanks in there? <gasps> Did he just get blown up? He's not even going to be pulling him. Is, uh, this might be like a hot take. But, it, oh man, he is. He's just, he's blown in half. He doesn't even know. Oh my goodness. It's just, you know, like... Obviously, I grew up playing the Call of Duty games. Some of them. Actually, I wasn't allowed to play them for a long time. My parents wouldn't let me. But I played some of them. And we just played these games for fun. But it just made, I don't know, it makes me think I'm like... Should we be allowed to play them for fun? I don't know. Obviously, like, you can. But it's like all these people... Uh, the games that are about the real wars as well. And, like, you know, glamorizing it. Making it into a fun game. When it's just like... For the actual people who were involved, it's nothing of that. I don't know, just a thought came to my mind. And I, f I have no idea how old these guys are meant to be, but I assume they're like my age, right? Or younger in most, I'm 25. Which is, it's just crazy to me. Oh, what, so they went to the right place but no one else did? Okay. So it's just, it's gone to shit, man. Oh, he's dead as fuck. No, there's bullets all through it. No, communication's gone. It's almost just like you're just there for your, not for yourself, but like these guys who are here just need to make sure they live. Oh my God, bro, medics. Uh, Bro, medics, look here, trying to help people. He just got shot in the side. Oh my, he just got shot in the leg. You can see the blood coming out of his thing with the water. We stopped the bleeding, we stopped the bleeding. These medics are just trying to help other people. Just give us a fucking chance, you son of a bitch. Oh, he got shot in the head while he was down. Wait, wait, it's Wait. Come on, let's move, move. 
Oh man, this heavy stuff, man. This is filmed so well. Shut up, you're not helping! I obviously know that I can never understand the situation. I Like, isn't crazy that some of these guys can stay calm in this situation? Oh man, they're just taking the ammo off the dead. Uh, I don't know what a BAR is. I don't know what these are. They're like big pipes. Sounds like some sort of like rocket launcher or grenade launcher. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh. Oh god. That is crazy. <gasps> oh. No. And they're just, some of them are so unfazed, man. Yo, to be a field medic is insane. What are these? I watched them set it up and I still don't understand how that worked. I'll have to look it up. Bro, shooting the other team's medic is got, is that's like a no-go, right? You would think. I don't know if it's a war crime. Obviously you can't tell in so many of the cases. Fuck, I can't move. Who's who? Yes, What's he doing? What did he just take out of his mouth? Cigarette or gum? Gum. Oh, that's smart as fuck. Use them to look around. I don't know what the drawer is, but... It's so overwhelming. I thought they need to be more synced up, man. Covering fire and they're going like underneath them or something. Just remember this whole movie, I have literally no idea at all. No battle experience or shit, man. So I'm just saying shit to deal with my stress. Oh, this dude's a sniper. Oh, good shit. What's this guy? Do? Is this a pr medic or a priest? I, I didn't realize there were like priests on the... I, it's probably called something else. They would go around and... I don't know, bless those who are dying. Wait, his one shot did that? Oh, man. He's dead, he's dead. Who are they fighting right now? I'd love to know. Bro, the set that they built for this is insane. Uh, this movie has just, like, uh, lasted the test of time. 25 years ago, this movie was made. <gasps> oh, he did not come out looking at all. Uh, they obviously people as well. Oh, that's a flamethrower. They're clearing it out. Oh shit, holy fuck. What, that was such a huge exp- I have no, is that what a flamethrower is actually like? I didn't realize it was such a huge thing of flame. Dog. Oh, they're surrendering. They're surrendering, they're surrendering. Ah. Oh. They're probably, some of them are just gonna shoot him anyway. That's so, uh, now you don't have the good ground and you're done mowing us down, you surrender. It's rough. It's part of it. Speaking Czech. They just shot him down. 
I feel ah, so bro, so many mixed emotions. What do you say? What do you say? Look, I washed for supper. <laughs> Was that a Russian accent? Hey, fish. Yeah. Look at this, a Hitler youth knife. Is that Vin Diesel? You know, it's a Shabbat holocaust, right? What the hell? Mm. You can't even like, I just, how can your mind even comprehend all of this happening? It's horrible. They made it through though. That's just, they're so lucky to have made it through. What's he doing? Well, he takes samples. How has he survived so long? That's crazy, man. He must be I don't, lucky as fucking a big strategist. Good at what he does. Point of view. Oh, this is the old man who we saw at the start. It's the exact same camera angle. Very well done. He's got beautiful eyes, Tom Hanks. So much death. The water's just red. So I wonder if they now, probably they go back down, right? And pick up a heap of the, heap of the stuff. Who's this? Ryan. Is this who they're meant to be saving? What are these ladies doing? A lot of ladies on typewriters. Ah. Oh. These guys are just writing out all the names of the people who are dead? What, how, what a horrible job. Important. I would be so upset doing this. What's going on here? These are three death reports. These look like military officers. Oh my god. It's him. I don't can't think of the actor's name. Both Ryans. They're all dead. Ah. Oh, well, this is saving the last brother. Is that what this movie's about? Oh, is this the mum? This is gonna break my heart, man. Seeing the families on the side of it is always really sad. And my, some of my favorite TikToks are the ones when soldiers like return home. Oh no, she knows what it means. You'd think about it every single day, hoping you'd never get this trip. Oh, it's a, a priest as well. She probably thinks that just one of them is dead. That nearly broke me right then and there. You know, like I live in Australia and I always say D-Day plus three, okay. How lucky, you know, Australians are to live in Australia. And I hate people that complain, just in general. I never think you should have a reason to complain. And um, I always say to Australians, you should leave Australia, go to other countries and you realize how lucky you are. All you need to do is watch one of these movies, right? You didn't get a good enough sleep last night. What, your job sucks? It's not that bad, is it? Not really. Yes, sir. Runner. But he's looking at all these luxuries these guys have. Is he seeing that he's been through way more than he did? This is the saving him. So he probably came up here. You guys might need to break that bit down for me. But I saw it as he came up here and then saw them all in like these luxury things. After everything they went through. Bro, they're just so calm with it. Like it's nothing. They've obviously seen so much. An American flag with a hunk of cheese in your ass, Caparzo, you smart ass. Now I listen you liked up. it in the ass. What? I thought you liked it in the ass. Man, shit! That was such an organic... That felt like that, that conversation actually happened with him there. Mm, this guy looks very... Not like you're gonna get in battle. Did you fire the weapon in basic training? Yes, sir. Well, then get your gear. Yes, sir. Ah. Uh, what horrible news for him. Oh my. That, this is such good acting, man. It feels so organic. Like it's actually what they're like. Take your time, Corey. It's all right, he understands. He's probably shitting, he knows that it's a high chance he's going to die now. Yeah. 
one thing. You don't need to carry those. You'll need that. You'll need that. That was that was improvised right then. There's no way. God, they're such good actors, man. Tom Hanks is so good. Wow. That's got to be a, a CG shot, right? Or like an artwork on the back there? But what CG did they have back then? Obviously not very good, I would think. But that, that was a really good shot. What the hell? I think they just don't overcomplicate it. It is what it needs to be. And they... They buckle down on the important bits and they just do it really, really well. 25 year old movie. Hey, I want your head blown off, you fancy little fuck. Don't you ever fucking touch me with those little rat claws again? Get the fuck back <laughs> to the formation. <laughs> I was wondering where you're from. Look, this guy's so nervous, right? He's different to the rest of you. Arza? It's a. Uh... Hey, drop dead, Corporal. Gotcha. And another thing, every time you salute the captain, you make him a target for the Germans. Understood. So do us a favor, don't do it. Especially when I'm standing next to him. Capiche? Hey. Mm, I have heard that before. Corporal, what's your book about? <laughs> hey, what's your work? Sorry. What rifles? Actually, it's about the... It's supposed to be about the bonds of brotherhood that developed between soldiers during war. Brotherhood? <laughs> <laughs> what do you know about brotherhood? Some Get a little of this boss. guy, fish. <laughs> Why don't you ask the captain where he's from? Yeah, that's the captain. I'll tell you everything you want to know about him. <laughs> they do this so well. It's about to start raining. I don't think this was like, like in Vietnam War. I'm pretty sure it just rain like monsoons, right? But I didn't think that happened here because it wasn't really rainforesty. Oh, these are other people on their side. What? Who is he yelling that to? Bro, look, watch. This is stressing me out. I don't want him just to get shot. <gasps> See? I don't know. I just feel like something's about to go really wrong. What does that mean? Thunder or we will fire on you? I don't get it. Oh, they're just civilians. Yeah, this is horrible. Vin Diesel, what are you doing? What is he doing? Did he just get shot? <gasps> Oh no, he's done. Oh no, he's done. Was it a sniper? What was it? He was on the ground before we heard the shot. So yeah, this sniper recognizes it. That's right. Come Come on. I didn't see it. 450 yards, cap, maybe shade under. Come on, brother. This sniper's got talent. <laughs> is he dead? Is is Vin Diesel just dead? <laughs> Bro, that would be me. Please don't cry. You're gonna make me just. Ah, oh, he's dead. Oh no, I don't think he's. I think he's about to get shot. Help me up, I can walk. I can walk. Caparzo, stay still. Who was that yelling? Wait. Come on, bro. Clicks. Left wind. Uh. It's hard shot for him, man. He can't see up there at all. Where's he uh. shooting, Captain? Oh no, this is all falling apart. Captain! He could shoot anyone else next. Oh no. Come on, you should know, bro. Oh my god, I trust him Yo, this guy's badass. 
Let not my enemies triumph over me. Where is he? Don't let him get that other shot off. Don't let him get the shot off. Oh my god, please, please. If he just kept his head down. Pop, you're gonna send it yourself. Put it down. I see it. Pop, I see it. Is he gonna finish him off? Come on. It's, it's to my dad. It's got blood on it. Oh no. Oh no, he's giving away where they are. <gasps> Come on. Oh. He, holy shit, that special effects has done so well. We got him. Sh shot him through his, his scope into his eye. Oh no, in his chest, that's real bad. Oh, man, these guys just cause problem. Yeah, you tried to give her away. I know you thought she'd be safe. Yo, our sniper is cracked, man. The way they bring the intensity in this movie is, like, very well done. I just always feel like I'm having to hold my breath. That's why we can't take children. Hmm. Did he die? Yeah, he did. Fuck. They're having to go through all this for this one guy. Imagine if they just get to the end and he's already dead because they don't even know where he is. Thunder! Come on in. Oh, it's their code. I understand now. This feels way too at ease. Like, something's about to. Oh no. <gasps> Are these Germans? What do you do? Someone's got to shoot first. Yeah, someone just, someone had to, someone had to. It was either going to be them or us. Yep. Yeah, I was like, did no one have machine guns then? Thank fuck they did. That's wild, man. They were just all sitting in there. Oh, okay, so he does know him. Is this him? Oh, he's about to find out. Is this another famous actor as well? They're all so young. Take a knee. Oh my god, it is. It's this guy. I don't know his name, but he's super famous. Well, pr I don't know. He's a famous actor. I wonder if he's going to want to, or if he wants to stay and fight. And he's the youngest one, isn't he? You would just be so empty inside of all emotion because you'd have to push it down. How, how did they die? Otherwise, you would just go crazy. Can't be. My brother's still in grammar school. What? Yeah. James Francis Ryan. Mine. No. Ryan, Minnesota. It's the wrong fucking guy. What does that, does that mean? My brothers are okay? Yeah, I'm sure they're fine. Fuck, get out of here. No one knows where anyone is. This is so, I'm like sweating watching this, man. This is so intense. Yeah, how do that, it's crazy to me. They just find these moments of happiness amongst it. Happiness and laughter. Hmm, then of course it comes back to reality. Mm-hmm. Maybe a hundred. Do you know how many men we've lost? 
And then my command. Hmm. He keeps track. What that means? I've saved a lot of ten times in a minute, doesn't it? That's what you gotta tell yourself. So you don't go crazy, right? There's so much responsibility to have. Mm, he's seeing the mateship. Wait, he would pretend to be asleep, so what, he wouldn't have to talk to her? Now he regrets that? Oh, man. And now he's never gonna see her again, maybe. This is such a good camera shot between the oh, thing. Hmm. Time you'll never get back. Man, this movie just hit like it's obviously emotional the whole way, but then it just hits you with those sucker punches of like emotion, ex uh, human experience. Damn, so many here. Won't be much longer. What are we doing here? You know, medic MVPs, bro. Yes, Check out that squad. See if Ryan's in it. This is just like impossible. How is such an impossible task? Are oh, these are Germans? Juden. I'm Juden. You know? Juden. Ah, he's stirring them up. Oh, these are people's lives, man. Mmm, there's just so many. What are these people doing? Why did it show him? He looks young as fuck. Oh, they're just seeing them fucking around with the tags. Ah, oh, they look like fuckheads, man. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, fucking idiots, bro. What were you thinking? Like I said, every single one of them was someone's life. And you're just there mucking around with them. Disappointing. What's... Ryan, anybody He's losing it. Ryan, you know a guy named Ryan? Private James Ryan from Iowa? Anybody know a Ryan? Oh, he's losing it. James he's just frustrated. Hey, Joe. Doesn't, uh, Mandelson pal around with a Ryan from C Company? Yeah, I think so. Well, bring him up here, would you? No way. Just like that? No way that's how they find him. Oh, this is... It's this guy. He's a... He's a famous actor as well. Ryan. No, 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 James Francis Ryan. All right, give me a pencil. Come to right eye. Come to right eye. Some, quick, quick, come on, yes. a pencil. Yeah. Write this down. James Francis Ryan, question mark, Iowa, question mark. Do, do you know him? Does he know him? It, read the message, look. Yeah, of course I know him, sir. Does he know where he is? It's not, oh, so it's not him? Yeah, yeah, we missed our drop zone by about 20 miles, ended up way over by a bumville or some damn place. No, this isn't him. A couple other guys were coming here to the rally point. Ran into a colonel who was gathering up men to go to, uh, Rommel. Rommel. To babysit a bridge. That's the last I seen of him, great, sir. Great, Th thank, thank you, right, thank you. Read, read, and thank you. You're welcome. Symbol on me. <laughs> 
So this is bad news, isn't it? This is not a good spot to go. Bridges never seem to have good stories in war. Obviously his hand's shaking and it's bad, but is it really that big a surprise to them? That his hand shakes now? I feel like that's, I'd be happy if that was the worst thing I had, just my hand shaking. So I just like shell shock or something. I don't know, I'm probably gonna eat those words. If you're watching this along with me, make sure you're drinking your water. Keep your brain healthy and juicy and keep that big sad away. Damn, they've been, are they rotten or are they burnt? I think they're rotten. God. The visual, visual effects? I'm not sure what the word, but like, the, vis, the what they have, you know, when they get injured and the makeup on them and everything is phenomenal. They do such a good job of it. And 25 years ago, Oh, okay. Seems like an unnecessary risk given our objective, sir. Our objective is to win the war. Hmm. He's right. I didn't even think of that leaving it there for the next person. Is something bad going to happen now? He's. Yeah, that's fair. Okay. I think thought maybe it'd go bad and then they're going to like have a little, you know, not mutiny, but. <sighs> they're going to. Hate him for it. Mellish, you hook to the right. I'll go up the middle. Who's going left? No one. Oh, this is... They're falling apart a little bit. Who's going left? Is the left the most dangerous? Left, sir. Maybe you should shut up. Ryben. What? Are they... Fire. Are they doubting him because his hand was shaking? If, if it's one guy on the machine gun, can they not just snipe him? Oh, he's about to see it in real life. Don't stay there, bro. I can't even see where they're getting shot from. <gasps> You're holding it the wrong way around? No, maybe not. Is he about to get shot through that? Oh, something bad's about to happen. <gasps> Did he get any of our guys then? They got him? That was really interestingly done, showing it from his POV. Oh no, someone got hit. Oh no, who got hit? <gasps> who is it? Ah, oh, this... Oh, it's the medic! No. What does the sulfur do? I don't know. He's telling them how to do it to himself. Oh no, he's, he's been shot like three times in the stomach. No, he's done. Oh, he's done. They can't, I hear the stomach's the best place to get shot in. But, um, what? Oh, this is horrible. No, he's done. Does does the sulfur does the sulfur sulfur stop it? This is horrible. He's still got his watch on. He's and he's still trying to tell him how to save him. Well, how's he gonna tell you, bro? He's dying. I could use, I could use a little morphine. Oh, that'll kill him, won't it? It's just gonna completely numb him. You, you, you can't save him. Wait, 
Oh. It's just so he doesn't feel the pain while he goes. Ah, oh, this is horrible, man. Ah, oh, this is the guy who... Uh, and now they're going to be angry at him because they said he didn't need to take the risk. Oh no, all for one guy. That didn't hit him, but it's okay. He's got to take his anger out. Well, they're all just beating the shit out of him. You know what? Fair. Let's do it. Everyone fucking have your turn, bro. Sorry, man. Everyone just beat the shit out of him. So are you going to let them kill him? Yeah. Not right. So you can help me with the bodies. What do you we He was shooting us back. I guess they're saying it's not right because he's like surrendered now, right? They were doing that on the beach. Just how, how are you going to know, right? Unless you have this, like, this one guy here who does the maps. Mm. They're losing all these good, like, they're close friends. Ah, oh, he's, it's hitting him now. I always talk about this in other shows that I watch, about the leader having to have a strong face and then crying behind closed doors so no one can see it. Ah, this is a big hit for them, man. I think that nobody really likes to see a grown man, like, properly cry. Tom Hanks is a phenomenal actor, man. And they know, he knows they need him to be strong. Who is this guy? Is this the guy they were just, the German? But they're giving him cigarettes? Huh? This is very rough, man. I like America. Fancy schmancy, what a sense. Go fly a kite. Get like you come. Come the beans. That's not helping. Betty Boo, what a dish. Betty Grable, nice gam. He just seems crazy now. I say, can you see? Hmm. Probably because he is going mentally insane, man. I think they're going to kill him. It's so rough because it's like, what if it was one of you, right? Like, you would want to obviously not be shot. You'd want to be taken prisoner. <gasps> what are they doing? Oh, I thought he was about to choke him out. Ah, uh, the discourse in the group is just going to rise. I think they made the right decision letting him go. There's so many different sides to it. This is such bullshit. You all got that right. Bullshit. Right. This is bullshit. Shooting prison every shit. That's against the goddamn rules. Yeah, well the goddamn rules just walked off. There's no rules in war really. But what if what if it's the other way around it's one of you guys? You'd want You'd want to be spared. Get your gear. Let's go. Uh, I don't know. What, I can never give like a thought on this because I, you have no idea at all what it means to be in that situation. Mama Ryan's real 
and happy knowing that little Jimmy's life is a little bit more important than two of our guys. But then again, we haven't found him yet, have we? Have we? Get the hell off me. Driving? Get up. Mm, there's got to be a, a hierarchy still, though. Otherwise, it all falls apart. But everything he's saying makes sense, right? you walk away from your captain drive and get back in line no, tom hanks say something now you're gonna shoot me huh why don't you just do it sarge this is horrible i hate this well put your money where your mouth is and do it then shut up you don't know how to don't do it please give me that pull on me up here you are a coward son of a bitch i'm waiting sarge i'm waiting what's the pull on me up to right now He's going to tell them all. Oh, this is so intense. I'm a school teacher. What? Bro, went from being a school teacher to this? So I guess I've changed. Yeah, you're not going back to being a school teacher. And I don't, I can't help but think, you know, like if, what if it was one of them and people were coming to try and find them to take them home? You'd want them to come and get you, right? If it had been like your brothers that would have all died or something. Look, in this war, literally all you have is like your camaraderie. That's it. That's all you got. Don't throw it away. What, you want to be back in the war shooting to die somewhere over there or shooting to fight here with your boys? I'm just, I don't know. I'm just saying thoughts come to my mind, but I can never, ever put myself in that what it was like, right? Who knows? Who knows? I'm glad he stayed. Oh, they're right out in the open here. Uh oh, rumbling. What is, is that a tank? Oh my God, it is. Wow, and they're just right there and you'd have no idea. Are they gonna be in between their own team? Their own, I'm just calling it a team, you know what I mean? Their own men. But uh, aren't the people who shot that gonna think that you're there leaving from the tank? There's just never, there's not a, a chance to breathe, is there? Oh God, oh God. Oh shit, they were right there. It's 101st. That was a recon element, second SS. Been expecting a probe. That must have been it. Captain Miller, Charlie Company, Second Rangers, Corporal Henderson, Easy Company, Five O First. Ryan, First and Five O Six. Gives the time. Be Third and Five O Six. Is this the Ryan? James Francis, Ryan. Yes, sir. Here he is. And this is a famous actor as well. I don't know any of their names. Woo, we found him. We found him. Holy shit. All right, now we actually got to do it. <sighs> Wait, is that Matt Damon? Which, which one? <gasps> oh. That's horrible, man. No, we're taking you home, son. You're going home. I wonder if he's gonna wanna go. I have my orders too, sir. They don't include me abandoning my post. I understand. Mm, so he wants to stay. Hey, Two of our guys already died trying to find you, alright? Hmm. But what he's saying isn't wrong either. He didn't ask for that though. What were their names? Owen Wade and Adrian Capazzo. Wade and Capazzo. Oh man. This just gets you feeling in like the the big sad, hey. Yeah. Everyone agrees in both sides.
tell her that when you found me, I was here, and I was with the only brothers that I had left, and that there's no way I was going to desert them. Mm. I think she'll understand now. There's no way I'm leaving this bitch. It's making me tear up, man. Look, you can be angry, but you got to understand that as well, right? You would do... Oh, everyone would do the same thing. No one wants to be here. What are you going to do? What if we just... What if we hold this bridge and then they can leave? Stay here, fine. Let's leave and go home. Yeah. But then it's like those two guys died for nothing. What if by some miracle... We stay and actually make it out of here. Mm, that's what I was thinking. I might look back on this and decide that saving Private Ryan was the one decent thing we were able to pull out of this whole mm. shittiness. That's what I was thinking, sir. Like you said, Captain. We do that. We all earn the right to go home. Hmm, well said. This is where the Germans are bringing all their tanks though, right? 17 grenades. That's how I understood it. I could be wrong. Yo, this set is incredible. Get you up in that bell tower. Yes, sir. Give you a little company if you need it. Oh, no. Like how he shot someone in a bell tower? This is very much the calm before the storm, I feel. Making jokes. Little bits of funnies before it's probably about to get like horrible again. Yeah, I need someone to tell me if this was a true. I'm assuming this is based off a true story. Yeah, I wonder what the details are like in this. Like, is that how they actually would transport the guns up by tying it to rope like that? Like how how accurate is this movie to like what actually happened? What what they would actually do in war? I would love for someone to tell me that. Beyond all recognition, right? Man, he looks so different now. Oh, <laughs> Ouch. oh fucked up well, beyond all recognition. Ah. Okay. Bro, I'm stressed. Now it's just this waiting game. I'm so worried someone's going to get our sniper like how he got that guy up in the clock tower. Remember reading the Walking Dead comics and the sniper we had in that, I forgot, I think her name was Andrea. And they talked about the lesson that if you have a sniper, you need to be a moving sniper. Because once you shoot once, they know where you are. The conversations that they have in between and the little inter interactions feel so real. Like they're actually just like, you know, these friends who are over there. I wonder how much of it is unscripted in these like little bits. It's going to be sad. That's the baddest surprise for me. So they took me to the barn up in the loft and it was my oldest brother, Danny. With Alice, <laughs> Alice Jordan. <laughs> Why? Why'd they bring him up there? Picture a girl who just took a nosedive from the ugly tree and hit every branch coming down. Damn! <laughs> and, and Dan's got her shirt off. So he's working on this bra and he's trying to get it off and all of a sudden Sean just screams out. Danny, you're a young man. Don't do it. Damn. <laughs> so Alice Jardine hears this and she screams and she jumps up and she tries to get running out of the barn, but she's still got this shirt over her head. She goes running right into the wall and knocks her. Oh, this poor girl, man. And Dan is just so mad. Oh. He starts coming after us. But, but at the same time, Alice is over there unconscious. He's got to wake, wake her up. So this feels so her. real. And he's, dra he's dragging her at the same time he picks up a shovel and he's going after Sean. And Sean's saying, what are you trying to hit me for? I just did you a favor. <laughs> <laughs> so this makes sense. Uh... He tries to swing this thing. He loses the shovel, goes out of his grasp, and hits a kerosene lantern. The, thing <gasps> almost, the whole barn almost goes up because of this thing. Oh my goodness. He told that story so well. 
Ah, <sighs> and then of course now the reality hits. Mm, I'm sure they just they just appreciate these small moments of calm. Yep. Fuck, <gasps> here it is. Here we go, lads. Time to get ready. No one really seems that worried though. Nope, never mind. Here we go. I'm so stressed. He sees Tiger tanks, two of them. Panzer tanks, two of them. Infantry, 50 plus two. Oh, fuck. So it's a lot. Okay, this guy is always just staring him down. Holy shit, we're fighting a lot of people. Damn, they're like... Like, they're dead, man. That's gotta be the worst job, what they're doing. Being the rabbit. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Here we go. What is that? Molotovs? Okay, I like this, how creative they're being. Yeah, it feels way too obvious as bait. It's a ton of infantry, Captain. I don't know if they took the bait, though. Oh. Sounds like it. Aren't tiger tanks, like, really difficult to deal with? Yeah, the sound design of this is really good. Oh, God. Here we go. Tana, is it going to come? Come on. That's so much. Oh, it's not coming. <gasps> Panzers didn't take the bait. That was the one vital thing. Infantry's moving to the left. Oh, this is bad. Jack just went by with about 20 troops. Wait, there's more tanks? They just need one of them, don't they, to come down here? Yo, that's a big boy. Holy shit, that's a big boy. Oh my god, here we go. Is this one of the tigers? Yo, that is terrifying, man. Seeing that coming down at you. When are we blowing? Sticky bombs, right? Something first, then sticky bombs. Oh my god, look at that. They're all so afraid. Are they waiting for this guy? No. I, I definitely heard the plan, but I'm just so stressed that I forgot. They are, okay. Here we go. All right, all right, it's going okay. Sticky bomb the tank. Here it is. Oh, come on. He just got blown up while he was holding it. Holy shit. He didn't get rid of it quick enough. The way they did that, man, I feel sick. All right, here they go. Throw it. Isn't this the point of the sticky bomb? Is that it sticks? Come on. Oh, yes, okay. I see. Oh, it's right there. That's good, that's good. What are we doing with these? Good. Oh, fuck. I didn't realize they exploded like that. Holy shit. Man, we got good positioning right now, I feel. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please tell me they're okay. Please, please, please. Yo, the smoke shots that they've been doing, they've both been on this guy. Those bullets bounce around in there as well. Get off of me. 
Are you all right? Get off of me! Yeah, I'm fine too, Captain. Thanks. <laughs> Why is he sitting on him? Oh man, they're just getting attacked from everywhere. Oh god, they all just got fucked up. <gasps> Shit, someone take it out. Oh no, oh no. Blessed be the Lord, my strength, who teaches my hands to war. Come on, son. Oh, he missed. No, he got him. He got him. Do not let that tank fire. Do not let that tank fire. Come on. Come on. Nice. He's got a lot of ammo. He missed. Got him. Okay. He's okay for now. They're focusing on him a lot. Oh no. You gotta shoot down that hole. <gasps> no. They're just getting smacked silly now. These two are still alive. They're just out of their big gun. Good reflexes, good reflexes. Ah, oh, this poor dude, man. No, don't, don't be a hero. He wants to help. You've got ammo, dog. You could get them ammo. What's he doing? Is he near them or is he just so afraid? Come on, dog. Come on. Come on, they need you. Yo, this camera work is incredible. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <gasps> What's he gonna do? Because they're coming up behind these guys now. Oh no, they've got no ammo left. Is this ours or theirs? Up them. Up them. No, it's not. <gasps> it is? No way we just killed our own guy. <gasps> no way. <gasps> no, it wasn't. Okay. Oh no, he's fucked. Oh no. Man, this just feel, we're, feels like we're losing this real bad. Like we're slowly getting overwhelmed. I need another bandolier. Anybody got a bandolier? Yo, there's a tank coming. This dude. I've been wondering where he's been. Yo, good shit. That's good shit. He is alive. Come on, help him. Oh, not the fingers, not the fingers. Help him. I can't, I know I've seen a lot in this movie, but I can't handle finger injuries. Go in hell! No, 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 no. Come on, dog! You were doing so well just before. What happened? 
He hasn't had to actually do any shooting. <gasps> Come on! <gasps> Shoot him! Oh my god. He's letting him get stabbed. You fucking dick stick on the stairs. You just let him get fucking stabbed. You gotta be fucking kidding me, dog. Look at you, you fuck. I know I can never understand that situation, but I'm so fucking mad at him. Everyone else is doing all this stuff and you're just sitting here. It didn't help your comrades at all. Oh. He just killed your friend. I'm so mad. You were fine just before. Why are you crying now? Ah, oh, I know I shouldn't be getting angry. I'm sorry. I just... I'm so mad that's how he died. When, I, when we could have avoided it. You were meant to bring them ammo. It was your one job. Oh, how do we, how does, how does Tom Hanks get out of this? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, please no one get crushed. <gasps> Holy shit! Oh, this is hopeless. This is, how does anyone get out of this? No way they didn't see him. How were they not see- are they- no, they're Germans, right? Yo, fuck this movie's good, man. Look at this set, man. Look at the stuff they're using, the special effects. Oh no. He's done. Oh no. Oh, they've been together so long. Mike, are you all right? I just got the wind knocked out of me. Get out of here! Take cover, we're gonna blow this bridge! Oh, he's not gonna make it. He's been shot so many times. Yeah, let's get rid of this nerd. Oh! <gasps> He just got covered in rubble and dropped the dead and no okay not covered deaf now though oh i thought his finger was broken i hate hand injuries he dropped the detonator though oh no not him no 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 i thought he was gonna make it Oh, no. Bro, the beating with the helmet is crazy. <gasps> I don't know who that was, but oh, they're done now. Is that Ryan? Why is he holding his knees like that? Oh, my. Oh, he's gone. Yo, how do we get out of this? No, he's dead, dead. Yo, this guy till the end, man. He's a G. His ears are bleeding. It's coming back. Come on. We have to blow the bridge. Come on. Oh, it's that fucking guy again that we let live. That one motherfucker. Yeah, you, this better be the one thing you accomplish. The guy who begged us to let him live said, fuck Hitler. Makes you better look and see. Was that not Tom Hanks? 
He shot with even a second thought in his mind, bro. That wasn't... It was. He just got shot in the stomach. He, he shot him without a second thought, even after... He probably couldn't recognize who it was. But after we let him live, man... Oh, came shooting this with a pistol. Was it not Tom Hanks, the old man at the start? Maybe I got, maybe I got trolled, man. I got tricked hard. Not giving up no matter what. Oh, for a second I was like, what the fuck? What kind of lucky shot was that? And where did he get shot in the right side? Probably through the lung. You best kill that one guy. There he is, kill him. Oh, I don't know what they're saying. It's not translating to English. Yeah, you motherfucker, shoot him. Yeah. Good shit. Fuck that guy, man. Fuck that guy. Good shit. Yo, I did not expect that at all. <sighs> Thank fuck you did something. So No, fuck it, I'm not apologizing. I'm sorry if people are upset. That's how I feel. Wow, some of us live, but hardly any. Is that Ryan? Yeah, he's got his knees up to his chest. Fuck me, Ryan lived. How did any of them live, man? That's, you just gotta be like, I'm the luckiest motherfucker in the world. Oh, we got reinforcements. Yo, can we get some fucking medics in here? Sir, P-51. Angels on our shoulders. Oh my god, is he about to die? They they tricked me. What, sir? Yes. Ernest. James Ernest. Hmm. Wow, he did die. I thought he was going to live this whole time. My dear Mrs. Ryan, it's with the most profound sense of joy that I write to inform you your son, Private James Ryan, is well and at this very moment on his way home from European battlefields. He's telling James that you need to, all this sacrifice, you got to earn it. Did not expect that at all. And this is why it's the old man. He obviously is so upset and everything. Because all these people, there it is. <sighs> that uh, that sacrificed themselves so that he could live. I wouldn't be able to sleep at night. Uh, I would always be working to pay, to do something to give back to mankind, to like pay it back for all those lives that those Good guys who made sure he made it back safe. It's just so many dead. I can't, uh, I can't help think about all the like veterans who would have watched this and seen that bit where he said earn it and how much that would have hit them that they lived. What a plot twist, man. They did that so well. I can't believe this movie is 25 years old. How do you return to society after going through that war? I know you'd be so happy when you come back to see your family and stuff, but how do you ever go back to a normal life? You know, I know I see so often that no one's ever, ever the same person they were before they left. And like, how can you ever forget those things? 
That was directed by Steven Spielberg. That makes a lot of sense now. Holy fuck, man. Now it all makes sense why everyone always said, I can't believe you haven't seen it. I like, I know I've kept saying it now, but I can't believe that movie is 25 years old. And I've just watched, like, and I've watched quite a lot of movies, shows, and that is so much better than so many things made today. It, like, of the special effects, the sound design, the acting in it was phenomenal. And I can just really see how, like, veterans would have gone and seen this and then, um, had PTSD in the cinema if this was real. If, if sorry, if what I heard was real. Um, it really just does make you think how lucky you are. Right? And that you really have no excuse to complain. Man, my drive to work was so long this morning. The road work sucked, man. Having this fight with my mum about this, what they want me to go to college, or man, that my boss at work sucks. At least he didn't watch your best friend lose his leg, have his face blown up, right? At least he didn't have to live through any of that. Those brave people who fought for like the chill life that a lot of people get to live today. And I know there's so many people that there's still a lot of war around the world, but you understand what I mean. <sighs> that, is, that, that is a phenomenal movie. I feel like sad now. I feel it's a sad movie through and through. It definitely got me in the feels there a lot. Um, but it was very good. Thank you guys for recommending it. I know I asked a lot of questions throughout it, but I'd really love it if you could leave a comment, let me know what you thought, or tell me if I missed things or answer some of the questions that I had there. I'd love, I'd love to know any of the fun facts from the movie, any of the fun facts about it, details that included things with the war. I would love that I read every single comment on all my videos. But I hope you legends have the most blessed rest of your day. Call your family, tell them you love them, and I always believe in you. All right, legends, I'll see you in the next reaction. Peace.